Good morning, you guys. We are outside of Publix. We're gonna head inside and check out some of the hottest couponing deals this week. We have a ton of great deals. We don't have any gift card promotion like a Visa gift card or gas card, but we have so many deals, we don't even need to worry about that. We also have that Fetch Unilever offer, spend 15, get five. You can do it up to four times. So I'm probably gonna complete that a couple times in my transaction today. Let's jump right on into it. It's definitely a great week at Publix. Over in the refrigerated drink section of my store, for the first time today, I found these Liquid Death Singles. This is just a sparkling water, nothing crazy, but I had not seen these singles in my store previously. They're $1.69. We have a Shopkick offer giving you a dollar forty, and then you can also submit to aisle for fifty cents back on one. So it makes one of these cans a twenty-one cent money maker. We have a pretty great deal this week on the Lala Chera condensed milk. They're buy one get one free at two ninety-nine. Now, if you live in Half Bogo, this is really awesome because you can pick up just one for a dollar fifty. You're gonna submit to Shopkick for $1.36, so it makes one of these just 14 cents. But if you do live in True Bogo like me, you're gonna to wanna to pick up two of them, pay $2.99, you'll get the $1.36 back from Shopkick. It'll make both cans $1.63 or just 81 cents each. I picked up another Parmalat Milk this week. They're $2.99, not on sale. When I bought it, I definitely thought the Shopkick offer was the same value as last week, but it did actually decrease. We are now only getting $1.48 back from Shopkick, so it makes one of these $1.51, which is not a bad deal. I did end up picking it up, but just be aware, it did decrease from last week. And these are by the condensed milk and the coffee. This is a non-refrigerated milk. We have an awesome deal this week on the Lipton Tea. They're all buy one, get one free. I'm gonna walk you through quickly the scenario that I'm doing today because I'm in True Bogo. We have these 40 cent coupons from Save 117. They are a limit of two, so I'm just gonna use two, but we also have a 40 cent digital. So we'll get $1.20 off in coupons. I'm gonna pick up five of these black tea boxes. These are the smallest boxes you can grab for $1.79 each, and then one of the green teas for $2.79. Since they're all buy one, get one free, I'll pay $1.79 twice and then $2.79 for the last two. We have a fetch offer for a dollar back on each black tea up to five, so that's why I'm grabbing five of those. And then for the green tea, we have an offer for 75 cents back on each. So I'll get a total of $5.75 back for from Fetch, but we also have that Unilever offer and Lipton is included in that offer. So for these six items, it's gonna track as 11.74 towards that spend 15, get five, which is awesome. And after the coupons and the 5.75 back from Fetch, all six of these boxes will actually be a 58 cent money maker for me. And that's without even including the spend 15, get five. This is my way of maximizing the fetch offers that we have for the Lipton, but if you wanna grab just two of those boxes for $1.79, it will be a dollar money maker for you with fetch and two 40 cent coupons. We have a pretty great deal on the Excedrin 24 count for $4.99. We have a $2 digital coupon, and then we also have a $2 extra savings book coupon. Both of those will work on this box here, making it just 99 cents if you do need some Excedrin. Be on the lookout for clearance chapstick. This one here is $2.49 in my store. We have a dollar extra savings book coupon and we also have a dollar digital coupon. So this today for me is gonna be just 49 cents. But if you can't find any clearance chapstick, they do have the chapstick singles up by the register. Those are $1.79 in my store. So using those two coupons, it would be a 21 cent money maker. I wanted to mention we have these dollar blinky coupons on the Sensodyne Pro Enamel. They're $6.99. They're not currently on sale, but we do have a Shopkick offer that's gonna give you $2.50 back. So this is a pricey product. I know it's hard to get deals on Sensodyne. So combining that blinky coupon with Shopkick, it makes it just $3.49, which I think is a pretty good deal. We have an awesome deal on the Dove hand washes right now. They're on sale for $2.99 as part of the extra savings book. We do have a $2 digital coupon 
It says it's for Dove women and it shows the body washes and the deodorants. It doesn't specifically say hand wash, but they do have a sign up in my store that says we are getting a two off of two digital coupon and it shows the hand wash. So that's what made me think it probably would work on these products. And I tried it out this morning. It does work. So grab two of these for $2.99, use that two off of two digital, submit to fetch for $1.25 back on each. It's going to make two of these $1.49 or just 75 cents each, but it's tracking about $6 towards that spend 15 get five on fetch. The Danimal smoothies are buy one get one free again this week. They're $3.09 in my store. We have this $2 coupon from SmartSource88 if you still have any of these. Grab two of these six packs, use two of those $2 coupons. It's going to be a $0.91 cent money maker on each two that you grab. We have an awesome deal this week on the OGX shampoos and conditioners. We have these two off of two printable coupons from coupons.com and the sale this week is buy two get $4 off instantly. We also have I bought a rebates, so you're gonna get $1.50 for each one you grab. There are two separate offers, one for shampoo and one for conditioner. So if you do grab one shampoo and one conditioner, you're gonna get a dollar bonus on Ibotta. We can make this deal even better because this is part of the Activate Rewards Spend 30 Get 10 rebate. So if you grab four of these, you're gonna be over that $30 mark and you're gonna get that $10 gift card as well. So I'm grabbing four today using two of those two off of two printable coupons from coupons.com. I'm gonna to submit to Ibotta and I will get $7 there. Remember, I'm getting $8 off at the register for grabbing four. So after the Activate Rewards rebate, all four of these are gonna to come to $2.98 or about 75 cents each. I know some of you got Tenna coupons on 11.7. I did not get them, but if you have Tenna coupons, you could pair Tenna with the OGX because they're both part of the Activate Rewards. So here's a scenario if you wanna grab one shampoo, one conditioner, and then four of the bags of Tenna. Tenna is actually a dollar off of each bag instantly this week. So use two of those five off of two coupons from SmartSource 11.7. You can submit to checkout 51 for $4 back on each two. So for those six items after the Activate Rewards gift card, it's going to be a $4.46 moneymaker. So I think that is a great scenario if you have the Tenna coupons and you want to grab some OGX. I wanted to mention the Tresme is on sale this week for $4 each. I'm not gonna grab any today, but this is another awesome option for the Fetch Unilever offer. You can grab two of them, use the five off of two coupon from Save117. Pay just $3 for both, but that is gonna track $8 towards the Spend 15 Get 5. So you could definitely grab four of them and complete that Spend 15 Get 5. That would make it just a dollar for all four using two of those five off of two coupons. I'm going to pick up two of the Dove Men deodorants for $5.89. We do have a two off of two Dove Men digital that is a separate digital than the $2 coupon I'm using for the hand wash. You can submit to Ibotta for $2 back on each, and then we also have a fetch offer for $2 back on two. So after the digital Ibotta and fetch, you'll pay $3.78 for both, but that is going to track over $11 towards that fetch spend 15 get five. If you want to use the Dove Women 2 off of 2 digital for the deodorant instead of the hand wash, you can definitely do that. They're on sale right now for $5.29 each, so pick up two of them, use that 2 off of 2 digital. You can submit to Ibotta for $1.50 back on each, and then you can also submit to Fetch for $2 back on two. That will make your total $3.58 for two, and it is tracking over $10 towards that spend 15 get five. These Simply Organic Spices are buy one get one free this week and we do have $1.50 printable coupons from GroceryCouponNetwork.com. So I printed off two of those. I'll have a link for that down below. I'm going to pick up two of the parsley for $4.79. So after those $2.50 coupons, I'll pay just $1.79 or $0.90 cents each. We have an awesome deal on the craft mail, but it's actually a today only deal. We have a digital coupon that expires today on the 10th, and it's also only valid for true BOGO areas. So you're gonna wanna pick up two of these squeeze bottles for $5.55. We have a three off of 10 digital coupon. So because you're grabbing two of those for $5.55, it is gonna take off that $3. It makes it just $2.55 for two of these, which I think is an awesome deal. If you're in half BOGO, 
Grabbing two of these is only gonna ring up as 555 because they're each gonna ring up half price. So that's not gonna prompt the digital. At least I don't think it will. I only tried it in True Bogo. I'm pretty sure it won't work in half Bogo, but if you're able to snag this deal, I think it's really awesome. These small bags of Hungry Jack are on sale for a dollar each as part of the extra savings book. We have this dollar coupon from Smart Source 117, and we also have a checkout 51 offer for a dollar back on one. It's just a limit of one, so if you pick up one of these bags, it will be a dollar moneymaker. I've already done my checkout 51 offer, so I cannot redeem for that, so my bag's just gonna be free. But tomorrow on Thursday, definitely check back on checkout 51 and see if that offer resets. I am so glad I didn't use my two off of two digital yet for the Raceroni. They're still on sale for $3 for two. We have that two off of two digital, and now we have an Ibotta rebate for 40 cents back on each. So grabbing two of these, you're gonna pay 20 cents or just 10 cents each. I'm gonna pick up some of these Thomas mini croissants because my kids love them. They're buy one, get one free this week for $4.69. We do have a 50 cent I bought a rebate and you can redeem both bags. So I'm gonna get a dollar back there. And then I also have a fetch offer for 75 cents back on one. So I think that's some pretty good savings. It comes to $2.94 for two bags or $1.47 each. It will be a slightly better deal if you are in half BOGO because that 75 cent fetch offer is just a limit of one. I'm gonna pick up some Febreze products because they're buy three, get $3 off this week, and we do have some good coupons. So I'm gonna pick up two of the small spaces, they're $3.29, and then one of the two pack plugs for $9.49. We have this buy one get one free coupon that's gonna work on the small spaces. It will just take off $3 and then the $5 coupon for the plug. These are both from the last PNG insert. Now I will let you guys know at the register, the $3 did not come off for me. So I don't know if for some reason the small spaces are not included this time. The ad and the sign very clearly say small spaces and then one through three count. So they should be included. I went to customer service and they did give me my $3. So if you can get the $3 back, it comes to $5.27 or just $1.76 each. We have a pretty good deal on these 35 count Clorox wipes. They're $3.29 and we have a $1.50 digital coupon that only works on this size. So you're gonna wanna pick up two of these, make sure you have that digital clipped and then you can scan and submit to Shopkick. You're gonna get $1.38 back there. It makes both of them $3.70 or $1.85 each. I think that is a pretty good deal if you do need some Clorox wipes. There is a Clorox bundle on Shopkick if you did wanna buy some bleach and some cleaner. You can buy all three products and get additional kicks there. So definitely consider that if you wanna buy some additional Clorox products. The Snuggle Fabric Softener is buy one get one free this week, so I'm gonna pick up two of these bottles for $3.99. We have a $1.50 coupon from Save1024, and then also a dollar printable coupon over on askteamclean.com. I will have that linked down below. The $1.50 coupon is just a limit of one, so that's why I'm using both of these coupons. It's gonna make both of these come to $1.50, or just 75 cents each, but if you do live in half BOGO, you could pick up just one for $2, use the dollar 50 coupon and pay just 50 cents. The Afresh products are buy one get one free this week, so this three count of the disposal cleaner is $2.99, so $1.50 each. We have dollar coupons from Smart Source 1024, so you can use two of those. Unfortunately, the Ibotta rebate is gone now, at least it is in my account, so definitely check. They have some other Afresh offers, but not for the disposal cleaner. We do still have a dollar over on Swagbucks though, so you can get $2 over there. So buying two of these is gonna be a dollar moneymaker. I only have one of those coupons left, so I'm gonna pass on this deal this week. We used to have an offer up on Checkout 51, but that offer is maxed out now. Maybe it will reset on Thursday, and that could make for an even better deal. We got a new I bought a freebie this morning for Health Aid Pop. You're gonna get $2.99 back on one. I looked on the Publix app and it said that my store did not carry these, but I did find them in my store in the soda aisle. They're $2.79, so already it's a 20 cent money maker, but definitely check your Publix app for digital coupons. I saw a 50 cent one in there, but when I went to the register, a dollar digital came off, so I must have had an older dollar digital. So for me today, this is gonna be a $1.20 money maker. The Challenge Butter is buy one get one free this week and it does include the whipped butter. These are $2.69. 
Now we do have 50 cent printable coupons on the challenge website, but this morning we got a new dollar off of two digital coupon. So you can clip that, you'll pay $1.69 in the store, but we do have a 75 cent, I bought a rebate, 75 cents back on each. So it makes two of these 19 cents or just 10 cents each. The Sensible Portions Veggie Straws are buy one get one free this week at $3.99. If you have one of these two off of two Blinky coupons, this is definitely a great time to use it. But we also have dollar printable coupons on GroceryCouponNetwork.com, so you could definitely print off two of those. We also have a 50 cent I bought a rebate. It's 50 cents back on two, so it makes it $1.49 for two bags or just 75 cents each. I am loving this deal on the Galbani Ricotta. We have this dollar coupon from coupons.com, but it only works on the double cream. We also have a dollar swag bucks offer and a dollar checkout 51 offer, both specifically for the double cream. So make sure you look for that in your store. It's $3.79, not on sale, but with the dollar printable coupon and submitting to swag bucks and checkout 51, it makes it just 79 cents. And you can grab up to three of these because Checkout 51 and Swag Bucks are both a limit of three. We have an awesome freebie on the Sargento Creamery Shredded Cheese. If you still have a dollar digital coupon, I used one a few weeks ago, but I think they gave me a new one because I have one in my account now. It doesn't expire for a few weeks. They're on sale this week for $2.50 and we still have a Shopkick offer. That's gonna give you $1.50 back. So with the digital and Shopkick, one of these bags is completely free. We have another awesome cheese deal this week on the Cracker Barrel. A lot of the different varieties of Cracker Barrel cheese is on sale two for six. We have a two off of two digital coupon and we also have an Ibotta rebate, one for the cubes and one for the Cracker Cuts. They're both giving a dollar back. So I'm gonna grab one of each cause then I'm gonna knock out two Ibotta rebates. I'm gonna use that two off of two digital and after Ibotta, I'm gonna pay just $2 or a dollar each. All right, you guys, this is my Publix haul for this week. Everything here retail is about $176. Now I did do two separate transactions because I was doing a couple experiments this morning. One of them was on the Kraft Mayo and then also on the Dove hand soaps. I just wanted to make sure that those digitals were gonna work. Both of those did work, but I did those on a separate transaction first. I just did that really quick. I also, did a little experiment on this Listerine Cool Mint. These are up by the register and I just grabbed it because I didn't want to forget later and I didn't know if the digital would come off. These are $3.29. We have a dollar Listerine digital. It did not come off. We do have a dollar paper coupon though. That one might work. You could also probably convince them that the dollar digital should go on this product because I think it just says any Listerine product. We have a dollar 25. I bought a rebate. So it makes it like a dollar if you have a dollar coupon plus I bought it. So I just wanted to try that. It didn't work though. These are up by the register. But over here, this was my small transaction I did first. You can see the two off two Dove came off for the hand soap and the three off of 10 Kraft came off for just buying those two Kraft Mayos. Everything else was on one big receipt after that and it is a very, very long receipt. So we had a lot of digitals going on. I had the two off of two for the Dove Men deodorants, the two off two Cracker Barrel cheeses, the two off two Rice Aroni. The dollar health aid is for that drink the Health Aid Pop. I didn't realize I had a dollar digital. I thought I only had a 50 cent, but I had an old dollar one. That one came off. Dollar off the Sargento Creamery. Dollar for the Two Challenge. Dollar for the Chapstick that was on clearance. And then 40 cents for a Lipton. I only had the one Publix coupon, the dollar Chapstick. All the rest was paper manufacturer coupons, and we did not have any issues there. I paid $73.76 before tax. We saved $88, but that does include a $5 sushi. I threw it over here, but I just couldn't resist. So I grabbed that as well. But the one issue that I did have was the three off of three for the Febreze. So it lists all of these items. It says one to three count. So I, to my understanding, this should all be included. I went to customer service and said the $3 did not come off at the register and they just gave me $3 cash. So if you understand why that didn't work, I don't know if maybe these are just not supposed to be included, but it says small spaces and then at the end it says one through three counts. So I would think that would work and maybe it was just a weird fluke and maybe for other people it's gonna work fine. But that was really the only issue we had today.
Over on Shopkick, we have a couple deals that we're doing. The Single Liquid Death, the Parmalat Milk, and then the Sargento Shredded Cheese. We have those three deals between Scan Kicks and Buy Kicks. We're gonna get about $4.40 from Shopkick. Over on Swag Bucks, we're just doing a dollar for the ricotta. That went through without any issues. Also, check out 51, just a dollar for the ricotta, so no issues there as well. We are submitting to Aisle for 50 cents on the Liquid Death. We have a lot going on over on Fetch. So I did hit the spend 15, get five for Unilever two times in this transaction. I had like a dollar or two dollars that I went over last time I did my Publix haul. So I had a little bit already to start with because it does track over time. So if you go a little bit over, it will go towards your next spend 15, get five, because you can do it four times. So I think I might've been at like $29 with this haul, 28, $29. So I hit that two times over on Fetch. I also got the $2 for buying two Dove deodorants. We got $1.25 for each Dove hand soap. We got a dollar for each Lipton up to five. That did give me a little bit of issues. It acknowledged it was Lipton, but it didn't acknowledge it was black tea. So I resubmitted telling it that it was black tea and then it still didn't give me the dollar for each. So I had to put in a ticket, but they took like 30 minutes and gave me the $5 there. So if you have issues with that, that should be pretty easy to fix. I did get the 75 cents for the green tea. That one went through without any issues. I also got the 75 cents for the mini croissants. That went through without any issues as well. So all together from Fetch, it was a little over $22. Now over on Ibotta, we did some damage too. I completed 10 offers. We have 50 cents for each of the croissants, a dollar for the Cracker Barrel chunks, and then also a dollar for the slices. $2.99 for the Health Aid Pop, $0.40 cents for each Race Ronies, I grabbed two of those, $2 for each of the deodorants, $1.50 for each of the OGX. So we had two different offers, one for shampoo, one for conditioner, and I did each of those twice, plus there's a dollar bonus for doing both of them. $0.50 cents for two of the veggie straws, and then $0.75 cents for each of the Challenge Whipped Butters. So 10 offers there. I also hit a $3 midweek bonus. So all together from Ibotta, we're at about $23. We're also submitting for the $10 Activate Rewards gift card for buying the four OGX because we're over $30 with those four. So combining my two receipts together after all of our rebates and everything, everything here cost me about $9 today which is crazy. We have so many good products this week that we have deals on. I definitely could have grabbed less things and been closer to free or a moneymaker, but there was just so many good deals I couldn't pass up on. I hope you guys have fun at Publix this week. Don't forget, I do have my Google Doc linked down below with all of the deals that we talked about today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to my channel if you have not yet, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Uh -huh.